Stevie Soap here. I'm back again. <laughs> and today I'm going to make something different. Um, at the moment I've just got my oils in here which I'm going to give a quick whiz. Just to make sure they're all whizzed it up. Now that's done. Pop this over here for the moment. And this out of the way. I'll put this board down. Because what I'm going to be doing is making a rainbow soap. And I've got one, two, three, four, four. I've got six colours. Actually, before I separate them. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to add them, add them. But I'm going to add um do them separately and I've got goat's milk in my lye but I'm just going I've got some whipped vanilla buttercream fragrance it smells absolutely lovely from New Zealand candle supplies so I'm just gonna put some of that in which I'm which I'm doing now as you can see I've also got some um, vitamin E but I'm not going to put that in just yet. Let's mix that up. Make sure that fragrance is all in there. And no, I haven't added the, um, what do you call it? I haven't added the um, lye yet because I'm wanting to, just, I'm doing things a little bit different. Okay, so I've, I need six colors and so I'm, I'm going to divide it up and I need 3.7 in each one is my six of them. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Okay. Now, colours. I'm doing things a bit different here because as you can see I'm in my kitchen because I've actually got a border staying at the moment. And he is staying in the um, in my soap room. I'm gonna start with we're gonna start with the red, but instead of the red, we are using a rose colour. Cause you all know me, I mean I just do it how I feel. <laughs> so that's the red bit. And then the orange is this um Called burnt orange, and that's by um, what is it, Michael? Your world, I don't know how bright these are going to be, so we will soon see. then I need a yellow. I will be mixing those so don't worry about that. Then we need a yellow and for the yellow we are using some old gold mica. Again from um, Mica Your World. It's quite a pretty, I like that gold. So that's the yellow. <laughs> And then we've got a green. Which is apple. Then 
cream of blue, which is the Electrac. That is so pretty. And last but not least, is the purple, and which we are using, I can't pronounce that name, but it's that there. Good helping of that in there. Put those aside. Um, so to keep it in order so I don't get confused. <laughs> Here's the red. So that is that out of the way. Now I need to put my gloves on. For those who are wondering, these are the gloves that I use. It's just the gloves I grab. I need this back. So I'll go back with we'll the purple first. I've got looking a bit worse for wear. But, and here is my lye water, and I put that on there and tar it, or tear, tar, however you want to pronounce it, T-A-R-E, and I need 1.8 of this per each one, so... Oop, there we go. Because I, as I said before, I'm just doing it singly. I'm just going to do them one bit at a time. Oops, so you will take that away for the moment. Put it on to high. Vitamin E. I had it right here. Where did I put it? Over here. It's quite thick, but it did come out. <laughs> This is probably going to be a failure, but we will see. <laughs> um, can I put 
put it into here. So it's just the bottom layer. Sorry, I know I'm a bit backwards doing it this way. You can't really see what I'm doing here, but I'm just pouring it. I'm just getting it in. Just that. I'm just gonna give it a little tap. Just to try and get those bubbles out. And we want it, we don't want that, we don't want it all up the edges because we want to try and get that size of that. So we want to try and get those edges nice and clear. Oh no, I can see a splat up this side. I probably just did it then. There we go. So let's pop this over here for the moment. And we're going to have the blue. a quick stir. Not too close, I don't feel like burning my nose off. And again, 1.8. Hope <laughs> you guys didn't hear that. Tiny bit of this vitamin E. Isn't that just a beautiful blue? Messes in there, aren't I? Okay. Okay, now we're going to bring this back. <sighs> now, what we're going to try and do is try. I can't get in there properly. So, I'm going to have to do it a little bit at a time, because this is a bit, because I don't want it to break through. That's a bit better, I think. <laughs> We do want those lines to be because it is a rainbow. Well, it's meant to be anyway. <laughs> so, we don't want those lines to break through if we can help it. I've made a layered soap before but not with this many colours in it. It was just like a little, I think it had like three colours or something, so it was a lot easier to control. <laughs> 
this here. Not so easy. <laughs> Okay, just gonna push those little bits in there nicely. Hopefully, it hasn't broken through, but that's looking not too shabby. Give it a little tap. Like I said before, I don't want it breaking through, and I don't want it all flicking up the sides as well, which is a bit hard not to do when you're making a mess, <laughs> when you're trying to layer it. I've got a big plonk. So messy. our next one the um, green this is up here give that a little stir again now 1.8 Six, seven, eight. There we go. Put that up, see, put that down there. And I know I'm not rinsing this between. I'm just not that dust. Okay. Vitamin E, and I'm actually going to put a few dabs of the vitamin E into the other ones as well. Well, I'm doing this one so that I remember <laughs> okay now i've got those vitamin e's in and where we go with this one the green I don't want it to be a really thin, thin, thin trace, but I don't definitely don't want it to be a thick trace because if it's a thick trace, it'll just be all blobby. This turned itself off, so I'm not sure how much I actually missed. I didn't miss much, but anyway, I am now back and I'm adding the gold slash yellow. And I'm going to see if I can just pull this one because it's a bit thinner. And the one underneath it is thick enough that it's not breaking through. Perfecto. little edges up. Oopsie. 
my dog, my puppy, Moi Moi running around. I have to growl him. He's trying to chase the flies, so I can't be too angry at him. He's keeping those annoying little flies away. Let's see what we've got here. Ooh, it didn't go over that side. Naughty. I think what it's done is actually because it was a bit higher. Oh, that's better. I think that was actually the green underneath it that was a bit higher, so it kind of came through. But that's alright. And what's our next colour? Is our orange. Beautiful, beautiful orange. need too much mixing because of the fact that it's um it's um well there's only a small amount in there so yep that's all set there so that's good That is doing what I want it to do. So we'll just pour again. Sorry, there's a fly. I think these top layers are going to look better than the bottom layers. Because they've come out a lot um, smoother. Might know that Michael Jackson song. Smooth criminal. Boom, 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 boom. Bing, ding, bing, ding, ding, ding. And yeah, you okay? <laughs> okay. Give that a little tip. That was our only little spillage there. Cool. Our red slash pink. <laughs> so I don't even need to weigh that. Because it's just what is at the bottom. Just trying to get it carefully. I don't want to splash it on me, obviously. But I want to get every little bit that I can. pinky colour. It's our rose. Nobody said the, the rainbow had to be the perfect colours of the rainbow. <laughs> okay. Oh yep. That sit nicely. Pour it this way for you guys. Okay. No, I can't pour it that way. I'm gonna have to like this. I believe that's working. Bit awkward kind of trying to see.
right. That is that. Give it a bang. Take off my gloves because I hate wearing gloves. Okay, I'm back with my alcohol spray and it's this Digger's. It's the one that I use from Bunnings. Give it a spray. Okay, so that is the rainbow soap that I have made. Oh, we'll come back tomorrow with the cutting. Bye. Okay, everybody, we're back again for the cutting of our um, the cutting of our rainbow soap. So let's get this baby out of the mold. Ooh, ooh, it looks a bit um overlap down the bottom, but we'll see. Set the ear in. I normally just kind of lift my finger there to let the ear in just in the corner and then once it's in, it's sort of, you can see the suction in here but it's still, there we go. You can kind of feel it do a little. <laughs> All right. So here is our soap. Let's see how it goes. Exciting, exciting. I love this part. <laughs> okay, we're going to use our one that looks like a chip cutter. <laughs> Mm, it's nice and hard. Mm, it's not too bad. It's not too bad. I'm quite happy with that so far. My first attempt at it. You can't be too um, fussy, can you? Give a bit of a line on the top there. I think it's actually not too bad. We've got our colours, the orange and the yellow have blended a little bit there by the looks, you can see that little line, but um, there's the yellow there and the orange there, so we've got the red, orange, yellow, green, blue and purple, it's actually a really good line in that blue, between the blue and the purple, I actually thought there'd be a better line between these two, funnily enough. But I'm still, I'm quite, a couple of bubbles, a couple of little bubbles in there, but it was a bit hard to make it unbubbly. <laughs> but I still think it's pretty good. I'm quite happy with that. What do you guys think about that? Let me know in the comments, eh? Tell me if you think it's pretty good or pretty bad oh this one looks a bit wonky <laughs> but there's some pretty good um, rainbows in there oh we had a bit of a block blah 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 over here <laughs> but you can definitely see the um, yeah you can see the difference of the colors and so that's pretty cool. Well, I think so, anyway. And if I think it's okay, that's the main thing. So we'll put these away to... Um, I haven't made the soap for a while, so it's kind of exciting. <laughs> They're all pretty good. That's a perfect line between the purple and the um, blue. And yet, those are the ones that I didn't think because they got really thick. So, it just goes to show. Yeah. But still. Nevertheless. These are one of my eardrums, so these will be one of my sample kind of 
ones but yeah so there we go these are my beautiful soaps and I think they're quite cool okay please don't forget to um, subscribe if you haven't already and like this um, video <laughs> and tell all your mates about it share it you know spread the love you know all that sort of mumbo jumbo <laughs>